Hello and welcome to another community tutorial for Cocos 2DX and this tutorial is actually more inspired by the community it's the sort of questions that you were asking instead of it being directly requested but still an important tutorial nonetheless this tutorial is going to cover how to add new files so for example we've got this new class we just got this project that we just that I just generated and how to add these on iOS it works great but on Android you need to modify another file before it can work so let's just open up Xcode and what we're going to do is go to desktop and we're going to just copy these to our classes folder here and then we're going to just move these over here and to build it for Xcode you just build it as it is you don't need to do anything else and everything fine and you'll recognize the new files and you're able to use them but for Android before you actually run the build native.py command what you want to do is go to your project.android folder you want to go to your JNI folder go to your android.mk so open this up in a text editor I'm just going to be using sublime text but even text edit is fine and here we've got the hello world scene.cpp we've got appdelegate.cpp and main.cpp here you want to add every single file you add whether it's a class or or not so you just do backslash if you want to add a new class then where it is as it's located in classes we can just copy and paste that so I'm going to do dot dot for slash dot dot for slash classes and then the name of the file is new let do for slash new scene dot cpp so let's just save that and if we go back to eclipse we're able to run this command and everything should be a-okay okay so now that's done as you can see there it says new scene dot cpp and it's compiled it if you didn't do that it would not have compiled the new scene it would have compiled basically hello world scene app delegate and main dot cpp so every time you add a new file you want to make sure that you put it in here if you add a resource it's a-okay but if you want to add like a cpp you got to make sure you put it in here that's it for this tutorial keep the questions coming in you can email us for support at support at sonarsystem.co.uk the email will be in the description you can also comment on this video or directly message us via youtube and as usual thanks for watching and have a nice day